Hi guys. So part two, we're gonna make a matzo brie that they're making in Turkey. Let's see what we have. We need two eggs. We need salt. We need matzo. I took a whole piece of matzo and broke it to pieces. And we need olive oil, butter, canola oil, any type of oil. And you need a skillet. You put the heat on medium. You pour olive oil to the skillet. We are going to break the eggs. We're gonna add salt. I'm going to take the matzo and break it even to smaller pieces. This matzo is one sh it's one big piece and I'm just crumbling it to very small pieces. And I'm going to mix it all. Again, you need to put the heat on medium. You want to stir it real well. And you want to put it in the skillet. I will turn it a little bit higher with heat. And I'm going to let it when you do when you're gonna make it it will be great if a parent can stand next to you and kind of supervisor uh, supervise hot oil cooking with hot oil can be tricky and kind of not safe so when you make it, ask for one of your parents to stand next to you and supervise. I'm gonna let it fry. It's gonna take no more than about three to four minutes to get ready. You do not want to overcook it. When it start bubbling, you know it start getting ready. So the bottom layer, the bottom is I think ready. You can smell it. And it's almost ready. We're gonna give it one more minute. to cook on the bottom. Yes, it looks ready. I'm gonna put it on the plate. And enjoy eating it. You can make it sweet by adding instead of 
salt you can add sugar and cinnamon you can actually sprinkle cinnamon on top or chocolate syrup if you want to have it if you don't want to have the sweets going you can just use what i used you can top it with parsley or dill on top and enjoy it